Welcome everybody to a new screencast. Um, this is pertaining to WordPress and how vulnerable WordPress can be. Personally, I can't stand WordPress, that's just me, uh, due to the fact that it always has this tendency of getting hacked or manipulated of some sort. Um, I wanted to show this to you because this is a relatively new hack um, that I, I haven't seen this before. It's actually a pretty simple one to fix, but um, it's basically kind of a new hack. So um, let me get right down to it. So basically I got a site. This is actually a friend of mine's site. And if you notice, every time I scroll up to the top, it scrolls right back down to the bottom. Um, I'm going to do a hard reload and see how it scrolls back down to the bottom. Okay, so this is Chrome, but when I go and look at it in Firefox, okay, this is the same site. Um, should do the same thing here. It's also per okay. So basically, what I noticed, and see how it keep well, see how it, at the bottom, right underneath my cursor here, how it keeps transferring all this data. Okay. Well, while it's transferring the data, is when it actually scrolls down to the bottom. Um, if you notice, see this little this little box right here. Okay, that's actually the hack. It's actually something that somebody planted. How? I don't know. But WordPress is really vulnerable. And that's why I never recommend it to anybody to use. Um, because it just is such a vulnerable site. Even when it's updated and you have all of your, um, uh, what do you call it? All of your plugins and everything updated and it's clean uh, and it's, it's, everything is good. You never know. Um, you get so many spammers and stuff that it, it, it's just such a ridiculous uh, platform to use. So that's why I hate using it. Joomla is a little less vulnerable, but um, that's in my humble opinion. Um, you know, everybody has their own, so uh, that's just mine. Um, but what I wanted to do is show you how to get rid of it. This is the footer down here. And underneath is this little thing. And see if you notice, this has a white line down here. Um, it's because this is supposed to be some kind of picture that is broken. So let's take a look at the source code so you can actually take a look and see what it is. Um, you see this div right here? This div is actually that little white box at the bottom um, that has the little, the, well, that little white area at the bottom that has the box. The box is this. I believe. Um, so, actually, it might just be this. Quite frankly, oh, you know what it is? I'm sorry. I take that back. It's an actual iframe. So, it's iframing this page, which is, doesn't exist. And so, the width and the height are this. So, it's got five pixels high by six pixels wide. So, that's why it does that. So, to fix this, what we're going to do is we're going to go into Chrome here, go into the back end, and then you're going to want to go into your footer. And then when you click on your footer, you're going to see this code. Now, this is just one out of like a billion hacks that could actually happen to WordPress, but I just happened to catch this, and I'm going to do this for my friends here for no charge, just, just mainly for the sake that I'm going to be able to post it on YouTube and show you guys about it so you guys know, um, and because it's a quick fix. Um, so all you do is you just take this area right here where it says div and HTML and you just delete it and then update your file. Um, if you want to know where this is at, it's located under your appearance and under your editor. So when you click appearance, click editor, it'll go to the theme, um, that you have already there in this particular case is AMG3. There's all the stock themes, but, um, it's in their theme here. Um, once I save it, and I go back here, see this white bar down here. Um, I may have to control F5, clear the cache. Man, it is still acting stupid. Let's give it a sec here, because I just had it fixed. I think it might just be a cache issue. But you have to clear your cache, and it should stop doing that. 
All right, there we go. So now it doesn't do it anymore. When I first uh, went back to it, it the, the cache wasn't cleared, so that's why. But um, that's that's the the hack that's there. Um, if you have a WordPress site, um, you're probably going to get hacked at one point in time. Um, it just happens. So um, hope this helps somebody. Um, if you need help with your WordPress or Joomla site, uh, go ahead and give us a call. We can help you out. Um, our info is right there. So either way, uh, thank you for watching our screencast and hope this helps somebody.